back again. So today we are going to do Never, Never Have, have I, I Ever. Ever. It's a couple edition. So today I have wrote some questions in a paper and I fold them. It's in a bowl. So we're going to play it. I don't know how we exactly play it, but we're going to play them <laughs> differently. We're playing it our way. <laughs> our way, yeah. So we're going to pick one of the paper and we read out the question. And who picked the paper, and they have to ask the question mm -hmm. to the opposite partner. Yep. If Chris picked one, he need to ask the question to me. So I will say, have I done it? Have I not? And if I have, then just say the little bit story behind it. Yeah, bit of information. <laughs> yeah. So let's get started. So after you. Okay. That's me. That means you need to answer it. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Never have I ever went on a double date. Double dates? Yes, we've been on a few. A um, couple of friends went on double dates to different restaurants. Uh, yes, we have. I, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> okay, <laughs> now you. Okay. Go on. Uh, never have I ever been hungover. Uh, no, yes, <laughs> yes, I don't remember. I have video evidence of her being <laughs> drunk, very, okay, very, the, very the, drunk. Shh, the very the good evidence of her being drunk, but I've also got some evidence of her being hungover the next day. So, yes, I think you have been hungover. What hung next over. day? Yes, it was very hilarious. You didn't even remember. <laughs> no, I don't remember. That's fine. <laughs> okay, I've never drunk in my life except. Um, Two times. Yeah. One is from the hospital um, send over party of yeah. one of my friends, and then my Hindu. Yes. I, I was drinking from ten o'clock until the twelve o'clock. Same day. It was. It was. It was too much for me, and I just. I was. I, I don't even know what happened. <laughs> but anyway. Yeah. So I. I just don't know. <laughs> let's 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 do the other one. Yeah. It, it's a weird story. Okay. Never have I ever sneak out from school. Yeah, I'm I'm a lorry driver, which means I didn't do too well in school, um, and that means yeah, that part of that was not being at school quite a bit. I did I did run away from school several times. It was just so boring. Um, I don't agree with the education system in a lot of countries because they tend to just educate the mass to pass a test rather than educate a child to be intelligent for where they are intelligent. But that's a different story. So yes, I have snuck out several times. Okay, <laughs> go on, it's your turn now. <sighs> Why do you get all the stuff? <laughs> right, never have I had a said I was already on my way when I was still at home. I have, <laughs> even on Saturday, I said to my mom. Yes. My mom texted me, so where are you? Um, on my way, Mum. But I'm, I was still at home, yeah. just getting ready. <laughs> so, sorry. Yeah, we used to meet up after she finished work, and she'd tell her mum she's on her way home, but mm, not so much. <laughs> no, yeah, it's weird. So, do you tell him my secrets now, dude? <laughs> right. Okay. Um, never have I ever stopped by a police. <laughs> Uh, yes, I've been stopped by the police several times, uh, mostly because I've got nice cars or I've had nice cars in the past. Um, when you've got something a bit sporty, a bit modified, the police tend to pull you over, check it's legal, make sure that it's actually safe to be on the road because some people like to do a lot of mechanics and stuff from home and they end up making monstrosities of bad cars. Uh, luckily, all of mine I've just taken to uh, a decent local mechanic who's done all the work. Um, but they used to have loud exhausts and sound systems and all other things that got me into trouble and uh, caught their attention, shall I say. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now it's your turn. <clears throat> Give me a nice one. <laughs> never have I ever gone on a camping trip. No, I've never, never been on a camping trip. Well, that was an easy one. <laughs> Don't know why, your but... Turn. No, <laughs> I never, like... That was an easy answer. I think nobody invited me to go on a camping trip. <laughs> but, but yeah. we will, we'll go sometime next year when this corona rubbish is over, okay? Oh, thank you. <laughs> With baby. But, 
Oh, his baby. I thought yeah. I was talking about going with friends, that kind of stuff. No, I'm going anyway, with <laughs> so never have I ever made a prank call. Um, probably when I was younger, but that was a long time ago, so I don't really remember that far back. I don't remember their story no, as much. Kind of a child's prank, I guess. I guess. Okay. Years ago, who knows? Yeah, it's he's he making it sound like he's too old and he's six. I am old. <laughs> I've got a zimmer frame somewhere. <laughs> right, never have I ever lied about the taste of what you cooked. Um, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> Sometimes she cooks food and it's delicious and I can't get enough of it. I'll just inhale the entire amount of food. Sometimes she'll cook food and I'll just see that little look in her face and she's like, please like it, please like it, please like it. And I'm like, mmm, tasty. So what's, what, what's the food that you don't well, like it? Well, originally I said I did like it. I did tell you eventually, but yoghurt curry. It oh, is yeah. bland and tasteless and horrible. I like strong flavours, something that's got a bit of a kick to it and a bit of a strong taste. Whereas yoghurt curry, it's almost the description of a lack of taste in my mind. You hurt my feelings now. Yeah, but I love your other foods, so it's fine. Okay. Oh, I'm <laughs> not going to make you that curry ever oh, thank again. God. <laughs> was it that bad? It was tasteless. <laughs> I love that. Like, all you need, yoghurt curry and, um, I mean, in Kerala life I say, morgari, right? With some pickles, it's amazing. Yeah. See, he just don't. never have I ever peed in a pool. Um, I haven't peed in a pool that I remember, but I do remember my parents telling me a story and everybody that I meet that uh, when I was younger, I was at the seaside and so at the beach and they sort of, I went up to my mum and dad being quite young. They said, I need to go to the toilet. I need to go for pee. And they said, well, just my dad answered rather than mum, which is probably where the mistake started. And he turned around and he says, right, just go pee in the sea. And he thought, you know what, I'd walk into the ocean, waist deep at least, and then just, you know, let the fishes see what happens. Uh, no, no, I walked up to the very edge of the water and started, um, yeah, I, yeah, out he, it comes, off it goes. It's like he, he was using the sea as a toilet. He dropped his yes. band and just peed on the, peed on the sea. Because I yeah. still remember that story when his mum told me and I was cracking. Yeah. It was... <laughs> I don't it mind. Was, <laughs> it was a funny story though. Yeah. Your turn. Never have I ever fallen asleep on my partner while watching TV. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to say it? Mm. Yes. Oh yes. A yes. oh, lot of times. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Like, he watched something, his favourite stuff yeah. sometimes. And I'm like, sometimes it's interesting, sometimes it's not. <laughs> Especially when he's playing games and mm. I'm like, oh, not not my thing. Yeah. So I just sometimes I stare and I just fall asleep on him. Yeah. And yeah. But we love Def a good cuddle and a nap on the Oh sofa, yes. But if in that case, like half an hour later he will turn everything off and he'll sleep with me. So. Yeah, it's lovely. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. Majority of the time. Never have I ever pretend I didn't hear you. What? <laughs> you always do that. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. He did it. Mm. I can answer that. Yeah. I said, babe, can you do that? He'd be like, what? <laughs> Sometimes I don't listen on purpose. Yeah, um, you just ignore me. Yeah, it's like if I'm in the kitchen making a lot of noise, like cooking or whatever, or whatever I'm doing, and it's like I hear her shouting, and I know what she's shouting for, but... <laughs> I think she should come to me and then, you know, catch my attention and then talk to me rather than shouting across the entire house. You know, I think... I, it, I will train her one day, but it's not going well. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's, it's the way I grow up. We just never... Yeah, you, yeah. her family shouts a lot. <laughs> I'll be sat in the house and it screams of... Ah, ah! <laughs> it's like my sister. Oh, and God. She, yeah, her she... sister's like a foghorn, you know, <laughs> like an air horn, you know, just two seconds and... Yeah, it's gone. It's just yeah. too loud. I'm like, yeah. I am pretty good, but <laughs> comparing to her, come on. Uh, yeah, I suppose. Yeah, I'll let you have that one. Okay, it's your turn now. All right, well, you got it now. Oh, never have I ever pranked my parents. So pulled a prank on my parents. Um, I, I wouldn't say parents, Esther. 
but I have pranked my mom. It went terribly wrong. Because <laughs> um, I was in school, I had a best friend. I had a best friend. Her name is Esther, obviously, mm. and we all we are close. She come for a sleepover. We mm. good times, and I told one day I told my mom. My sister was standing next to me, and my my mom was like doing a washing up or something. And I told mom, uh, mom, I think I'm into girls, not into boys. I think I'm a lesbian. <laughs> I, I just want to see her reaction yeah. because I know majority of the Indian parents, just they go mental. Um, yeah, <laughs> she, she did. She wasn't very happy. She, the first thing she turned around and said, I know it's your friend, Esther, isn't she? <laughs> I was like, God, I see you every time talking to her on the phone. She come over for sleepover. You don't sleep at the night. You're always giggling. I'm like, wow, mom. That was so deep. <laughs> then I told She'd him. She'd been thinking about it. <laughs> yeah, so I told mom, mom, that, that was a problem. I do like boys, okay? I just like boys. I'm not into girls like that, okay? It's just, just boys, don't worry. And then she was a bit relieved. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, it was, it, it was, it was odd. I still remember that day. It happened like yesterday. God. Her, her reaction is priceless though. Mm. Never have I ever dropped anything in the toilet. Not you? No. Drop nothing. I have my glasses <laughs> at work. Yeah. <laughs> in the toilet. Yeah. I mean, you know, work, everybody uses it, but I have, yeah. yeah. And I still have that glass. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'll pick up a different one now. Okay. Go on. Right. Never have I ever lied to my parents. Well, frankly, I was a child at one point, many, many years ago. Um, yeah, of course I did. Who, what child doesn't lie to their parents? I have a lot of times. Yeah. And sometimes the thing is, if you lie to your parents, they will get you. Yeah. Look, my mom literally look at my eyes and say, you're lying, aren't you? And I'm like, mm. <laughs> And she goes like, I can read it from your face. Yeah. Yeah, so. Never have I ever laughed at an inappropriate time. Inappropriate laughing. I'm very much a person, I will laugh at whatever I want, whenever I want. Um, I mean, like, if someone talking very serious stuff, and you have you laughed at that, it's something serious going on, but it just crack you up, so you just start laughing. I can be annoying sometimes. Sometimes if someone's too serious, I'll just point and laugh at them. Um, <laughs> just because I can. Yeah, um, I mean... I can't think of any real examples of laughing at people or whatever, but I'm sure it's happened at some point. Who hasn't? Okay, the last one. Last one, let's have a look. Ask me. Come on, let's see what's in there. Don't know what's in there. Right. Uh, cool. Never have I ever been chased by a dog. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, I have. That was an easy answer, there you go. <laughs> when, I was, when I was young, um, we, there was a street dog. He was like sleeping peacefully. I think that annoyed me. The dog was sleeping peacefully. <laughs> so I had this very thin stick, mm. and I was playing on his like in nose, like making him sniff and stuff like that. No, <laughs> just like that, and it it did annoy the dog. I woke up the dog, and it chased me and he bit me. Ever since I hated a dog until I met a puppy yeah. two years ago. Yeah. So yes. I have, unfortunately. <laughs> it wasn't. It wasn't a great time. I no. scared. I was scared to death. There you go. So yeah. So that's our never have I ever couples edition video. Couple editions, yeah. yeah. Um, if it, anybody's got any suggestions of videos that they'd like to see, different games, different activities, different um, challenges, different challenges, yeah, let us know what you think. Um, nothing too wild, but be creative, <laughs> and we might make a video about it, and we'll give you a shout out in the in the comments as well. Yes. So, Leave the comments, leave a like, uh, subscribe, share the videos. <laughs> yeah, subscribe to our channel yes. and like us. If you like us, follow us and yeah. subscribe again. Yeah. So, yeah, I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye. Bye.